checking in so you know I didn't die at IHOP or something. This has been my morning. Except it's afternoon because I got up at 1. Good job, Spags. Finally off of my couch from editing. I'm gonna go run off some of the bad decisions from last night. You'll notice that Kim nonstop wasn't at IHOP with us. It's probably why she always wins the ab offs. People that came to my free paintings live stream got an exclusive early announcement, and now you guys are hearing about it. I made a frantic last minute appointment to hopefully get a new passport tomorrow. Why? Thursday to Saturday, I will be Snapchatting you from Cancun. Yeah. Details on that coming soon, but first, I gotta deal with this passport thing. Ugh, I gotta fill out all this stuff and then get a passport photo. First, let's look at my old one. <laughs> I specifically wore my welding jacket so it would look like a prison picture. <laughs> what photo am I using this time? I printed out this guy, which is actually from my Instagram, a photo booth where I was turning down. Much as I would love to show up in a lion onesie and make them take a picture of me, they probably wouldn't allow it, so this vaguely annoyed expression is probably the funniest thing I can get away with. Speaking of lion onesie, I just shot a lion-themed 15-second mashup for Instagram, so go look for that soon but not before I take this off. It is really hot, oof. I'm headed to the passport place. I have to convince them to give it to me today because they don't always do that. And if I don't get it today, I can't go to Cancun. And the company that's sending me will be pissed. This will take all of my charming power, which at 7 a.m. is limited. Good thing I wore pajamas and didn't comb my hair. Off to a bad start. I got here on time, but now this line to get through the metal detectors is making me late. Cop behind me said that they might not accept my photos. He was like, that's a real, uh, you may have some trouble. It was like he wanted to help me out, but he couldn't say, you look weird in that. <laughs> They're not gonna take your photo. So now I gotta charm them to give it to me today and use this photo. So much has already happened that I can't show you because one of the things that happened is that I got yelled at for taking photos in the federal building, which apparently is not allowed, so I'll fill you in later. That place just breeds miserable. Babies were crying, adults were crying. Standing in the third line to get to the fourth line, when I got to the front, they said my form was filled out in pencil and that was unacceptable. So I had to fill it out again and then get back in line. I was standing in the fourth line, the girl in front of me had stood in all the lines twice because they rejected her photos. And she had them officially taken at like a photo place. I knew I was screwed. Got through the final line, the woman was like, what is this you're holding in the photo? And I was like, uh, I think it's just a part of my shirt. And she's like, there's a shadow on it. I'm like, she doesn't care about my face, she cares about the thing I'm holding. She was like, take your glasses off, which I did. And then I kind of froze, gave her a little smirk and said, it's me. And so she accepted it! Lucky me gets to come back to the place that breeds misery this afternoon to pick out my passport. I'm going to Cancun! I'm going to pick out my passport and I'm biking this time because it's not 7 a.m. anymore and it's gorgeous out. A gorgeous day to stand in several government building lines! This is the line in which I'm standing. And I'm thrilled about it because one, I'm outside and two, I'm doing it with Ashton. But seriously, what the hell? What the hell? Line number two today. I mean, minus the ones I stood in before. Welcome to line chat. Are you enjoying watching me stand in lines? I'm allowed to be shooting in here, but guess what's in my backpack? This dude over here, I don't want to shoot him. He just, he just walked out of the building. I don't know where he's coming from. And he screamed, fuck, at the top of his lungs. This place breeds misery. Anyway, I'm not miserable, as you saw from the photo. I got my passport. I'm pretty sure the only reason I got it is because I was the first person to smile at that woman in like years. As a payment for making me wait in lines all morning and afternoon, I figured maybe I had deserved a passport then. Did I just steal from the government? She wanted to see the final. There's my dumb face on my actual passport that I have to use until it expires in 2026. Before I leave the country, I wanted to check to see how the popcorn is doing from that video. Oh good, there's some missing. Totally plenty missing. There are prop eating birds in LA. Also, before I leave the country, I gotta say CrossFit a bunch of times and then go to CrossFit. So I'm headed to CrossFit. CrossFit. And showered before the plane. But why, Spags? Why not just gross out the people that are this close to you? Well, TBS let me bring a friend, and so I guess I'll be nice and not smell bad for her. Uh, you guys know her. TSA guy told me to have a nice flight, and I was like, thanks, you too. Uh, oh, I mean, whatever. LA actually wants me to see a bunch of dudes with their pants down because. There's the men's room, so I walked over into the men's room. What? Outfit look familiar? Yeah, it's the exact one that I'm wearing in my passport photo. Yeah, Mexico, that's me. You can't deny it. I'm not taking any chances. It was a little hectic. We're on the plane. This is my co-star for the weekend, Kathy. She's the one that gave me the tattoos. If you haven't seen that stunt, it's coming out tomorrow on YouTube. What are you wearing? <laughs> I made sure that TBS flew us with two tray tables. That's right. 
dual table flight. That's how important we are. So important. I picked up in an SUV with a TV and water and mint towels. I'm not fancy enough for this. Think of being the one that gave me the tattoos on her birthday. Look. <laughs> oh, I'm not even, I'm not flexing. Why did you have that? It really just blew my mind. This is insane. I can't even snap you. Um, we'll get there. Oh, cool. The golf cart's here to take us to our room, which is like forever away. It's huge. You know, not too bad. How's your cucumber water? I'm just gonna keep saying fancy. Excellent. It's too fancy. You from my room. What? Holy crap, the room is amazing too. I don't, is this real life? Look at this bathroom. Are you kidding me? I can't pee in here, it's too nice. This explains the golf cart. That's the main entrance and that's where we're staying and this is the whole resort. It's huge. I think I'm just gonna stop talking for the rest of this trip. TBS brought us here. I know I said I wasn't gonna talk, but is to watch this show, and I'm probably gonna sit right there. Oh my god! For you guys, what, what? Um, we're just so excited to be a part of it and to, to finally share this show. Holy oh, shit, that guy's handsome. Is he like six five or something? The bathroom has paper towels made out of cloth. That's, I think that's. I think it's just called towels. Look. This is insane. Guys, check it out. Bree S. Rig is here. What's up? And Steve Zaragoza. What's up, dog? Your favorite internet personality named after your favorite coffee. <laughs> Hi. Um, I forgot to shoot a lot of things because we got real drunk. Hello. Margaritas, tequila in Mexico. This place is still gorgeous, still fancy. Okay, here's the problem. I said I was going to stop talking about this and just show you because you were probably sick of me freaking out about how amazing it is, but I can't stop talking. I'm sorry, what did you just say? This is why you're here, by the way. I just way. want to do a handstand. Yup. Go. Yes. The best part of this is that she has these gentlemen holding her stuff. Oh, yeah, bad. get it, girl. We made it to the... Hi. What are you mad about? Don't flick me off. We made this crazy cigar bar. Mexican cigar. This gentleman here. Alright, I'm pretty sure all of those snaps made like not much sense, but the point is, I'm in another bathroom with towels made out of actual towel, and I wish you all were here with me. People know Ali has a charger in her pocket. What's wrong with that? It's She's, a tie, by the way. She walks so around with a gun off. Stop it. I, I don't remember the last thing I snapped. We've been having a lot of tequila. Look, I'm on a bridge, and that's like, I don't, an infinity pool? This is insane. It's really hard to show you what's happening. We just got yelled at for skinny dipping, basically. Being naked. In Mexico. This is Mexico. Can't you just be naked in Mexico? We snuck past the hotel guy that yelled at us to this pier. Oh my god. Ty is spearheading the idea that we should jump off this. Uh, do I want to live? Alright, despite my good judgment, are you coming too? We're gonna jump off this pier, even though we, like, it's not, it's not safe. I would, but if I, I don't have okay. I have zero clothing on right now. <laughs> we are going. Are you mad you're not going in, right? Or something? We're all going in, but him. I'm in. I couldn't film the water part, but absolutely nude. But we got naked. In this Mexican water. I think I hurt my foot, actually. I tripped just walking down the Normally, I pride myself on being good at showing you what happened. But it's hard when we jumped in the water naked. I don't, my phone's not waterproof. Dropped my crew off and now I'm getting dropped off. Number nine, nice. Oh, thank you. Have <laughs> a good one. What? Oh, good morning, Mexico. And good morning, Snapchat Pally. Just came out here to watch back my snaps from last night, you know, just in case. And I've learned I'm bad at editing under the influence of Mexican tequila. Sorry all those snaps were long and almost nonsense. Oh, I did say something important. Ugh. This happened. When we were jumping off that pier, I messed up my foot. You can kind of see it, it's like bruised. Um, I mean, forget that, look at this view. <laughs> I hope my foot's okay, because you know, I gotta like crossfit. This is the part where I should shut up, like I said I was going to. Hey, crow. Giant lizard in there. Like, where can you see him? 
He's huge. Move around, dude. There you go. You guys think I've just like been in a truck stop taking pictures of postcards? I'm not actually here to show you me in the space as some video proof. Living the dream. Skimming an infinity pool for a living. I want this job. Now it's a beach party. They're like a bunch of activities for all these influencers and food and booze. Okay, cool. That's the TV show that we came to check out. Wrecked on TBS. Hashtag spot. No, seriously, though, check it out. Because we watched it last night. It was so good. Look, there's a plane wreck. Just did a bunch of water stuff, including paddleboarding. That was me earlier. I didn't fall. I know you don't believe me. It got really windy and, like, ominous. It's dark. And they started cleaning stuff up because it's, like, going to rain. It came out of nowhere. Crazy. It doesn't feel real. Like, everyone's running from the beach. It's really like the hard, out of nowhere. In the room they left booze and a waterproof case for today, which I didn't notice because I got home with lots of tequila in me. I could have shown you the water sports. Oh well. Stop draining. And we are enjoying espresso and I don't know, some Mexican cookies on our porch. Unreal. Sitting here, I am posting the new Spags chat because they have Wi-Fi. It's crazy because it's actually got Kathy in it. Perfect timing. Go watch that. She puts terrible tattoos on. Can you recreate it? Nope. No. One more. You got 10 seconds. This yeah. weird Mexican beverage. What? That's so cool. Still raining, but I'm now able to snap you, courtesy of Wrecked coming to TBS soon. My phone is waterproof! Where are we? Uh, <laughs> we just walked to this infinity pool and nobody's here. Time to own this ourselves! How's that whiskey? <laughs> Look at this! Guys, I definitely don't deserve this. <gasps> Third take trying to figure out how to make this happen video underwater. And we found another infinity pool. We have a problem, we get an intervention. We just can't stop finding infinity it. pools. <laughs> it's not okay. We need help. <laughs> Alright, we're in a pool now that has a bar that you can just swim up to it. Just in the pool and at the bar. Holy crap. Stools underwater at this bar. Is it raining? <laughs> probably raining. Look at this. He's been in the water so long. Face face me. It, okay, it's not Rain capturing. They're like white. You look it's like a disgusting. cadaver. It's insane. Just left to go to the bathroom quickly and I found another infinity pool. I have a problem. We just keep finding infinity pools. I need help. Every infinity pool oh. we're in. Because she's singing now. Look, everyone's out of the pool. Like, they might get wet in the pool, so you get out because it's raining. Wet. Wait, ma'am, do you have a drinking problem? I what? No. <laughs> I got yelled at for doing this earlier. Like maybe five minutes ago, but now I'm doing it again. And on camera, oops. Okay, I gotta go. Walked around the perimeter of that, which is like a six foot drop and absolutely prohibited. Anyway, new story. I just remembered that I forgot to put sunscreen on all day. Tomorrow will be burn chat. <laughs> You laughing about it, right? Nope, run away. Why do I agree to this? All right, well, tattoo a hole has tattooed me again. No, no. <laughs> Hi. Hey. If you're gonna do it to me, don't be. You're. This is going on you. Like in like bicep area. Do it then. No legs. Where? I'm Face. I'm actually <laughs> surprised this that. happened. It's not even a fucking. <laughs> She That's what you tried said. to make me put on her stomach and literally just attacked her face. I'm sorry. <laughs> of course they have another party planned for us tonight. And I feel like you knew this was coming. But here it is. I found another infinity pool. <laughs> This is like the five billionth snap that I've like shot and deleted because I'm trying to show you. They built this amazing snap, this crazy party. Look, I'm wearing this dumb vest. It was unbelievable. Oh, this is 
this sounds like nonsense, but as I was filming that last nap, I dropped my phone. The guy driving the golf cart drove over it. I had to make him back up to get it from under the tire. Thank God for this new case. Morning, Snapchat Valley. I made it to breakfast this time, and it's kind of ridiculous. It's time to eat my face off at the airport, and I have a fish spa. I guess you put your feet in with the fish. Anyway. The luckiest person on the planet. First of all, I just went to the bathroom, and I was sitting right here, and it started raining. I just missed that happening on my head. Did I mention it's raining indoors in this Mexican airport? What? I'm just gonna take a photo of me taking a nap, and then I noticed that this is still on my arm. Great. Oh, uh, the first one's on my back, too. What'd you just say? That's a piece in Mexico. <laughs> I'm gonna give you guys a little blast from the past. I haven't heard that sound in forever. Put contacts in and changed into workout clothes at several red lights because I'm headed directly from the airport to a fitness TV show pilot shoot for GQ. And immediately following that, I'm going to another influencer party at the Getty Center. So yes, my life does not stop. Uh, I don't even have time to take off this stupid tattoo. Here yeah, for well, 10 minutes. It's weird and quiet, the shooting inside and hand standing out here. Another full wardrobe change while driving, and now I'm at the Getty to go to another thing. So far, this has like been my dinner. Great. I should be snoozing and talking to people. Oh, so it's a hybrid. But I just keep stuffing my face. I'm very hungry. <laughs> Oh my god. We crashed. I'm ready to go look at on the internet. Just be gone. Oh.